Nobody else was like, what's going on over here on my hot chin? Nobody else was really telling me I was sexy like that. And um, I said, you know what? Girl, you know plant, tech not plant technology. You're an alchemist. You know how to put some herbs together okay. to bring the sexy back. Uh, tap into the, the sensual side of yourself and activate that ignited honey. Set it on fire. Don't listen to Americans burn something, okay? <laughs> so, I put this here blend together, okay? This here blend together, sensual blend. And it has some herbs in it. You want to know one of the herbs? When I tell you this one, you'll be like, yeah, baby child. Horny goat weed. Shit. What? Need I say no? Don't say it. Horny goat weed. Is the first ingredient. Amen. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Next, we have maca root. Maca root helps balance the hormones, lifts the mood, and the libido. All those things. Honey. Cinnamon, rose petals. Okay. Ghirardella dark chocolate. The darker the berry, the sweeter the juice. Okay. So I put this here together, and I'm going to do another video to show you how to use this to make a very sensual drink. Now, mind you, I said Sensual, mm. not sexual, mm. because sensual, sensuality is about getting in tune with yourself, activating all the senses. Touch is one, honey, taste is another. Mm. Smell. Mm. That smells good. It's, that's my favorite. Ooh, it's, it's lovely. lovely. It's lovely. It's divine. It's got cinnamon and honey granules in it, okay? Um, smell is another one. We just smell. Seen is another one. Looks beautiful. Has rose petals in it. Did y'all know y'all can, when it's culinary grade, did you know that you can actually partake in rose petals? Yes. It's MST. So, so simple, yet delicious. And then we are going to add a tablespoon of butter. So y'all can see like how much a tablespoon is. Is about that much. Okay? Alright. So we're going to add it to our pot. And this that I'm making, it actually makes two drinks, okay? Two drinks. All right. Next, I didn't get my, oh, I can use this right here. Next, we have our honey. Honey, okay? And as this is melting, all right, we're going to add some honey. How much, Dr. Michelle, is to your taste and to your liking, okay? That's all I'm going to add. That was probably about a tablespoon, okay? And then we're just gonna mix together until all of the butter has melted. And then that's it. See? Super simple, right? Super simple. Now, normally, we would go ahead and add this to a cocktail glass. Isn't that pretty? But this is so hot, I don't want it to break the glass. All right? So then we are going to, let me bring it up here for y'all. That's good. Then we're going to add this to the tea. Okay, stir it up. Let's move this out. Then we're going to take our rum. We used this Appleton the other day. Some delicious, right? Some delicious. Normally what you would do is add equal parts rum and vodka. So I'm going to add just a little rum. Y'all know I'm heavy handed. I, was, I say a little and then <laughs> we don't know what's happening, okay? <laughs> you know what? I'm going to put this in here with a tad bit of ice. Just a tad. Just a tad. Not a whole lot, baby child. Just a tad. Because I don't want to really dilute it. You know what I'm saying? Let's give a taste right quick. Uh, 
Oh, that's good. Mm. Oh, that's good. You can I could have even added a little more butter if I wanted to. Honestly, this drink is so good, we can leave it just like that. But you know, I always like to add a little something, something extra to it. So, in an experiment, what we're going to do actually is add just a splash of the amaretto. Just a little splash. I think that's really going to enhance the flavors because amaretto has a cherry type of flavor. And what's better than cherries and chocolate and cinnamon and that goddess Damiana? Oh, y'all don't see the I really am going to add just a splash. Y'all know I'm heavy-handed? Yeah. Okay, just a little splash. That was a little more than a splash, but I didn't, I didn't do too bad that time. I didn't do too bad that time. <laughs> then we're going to stir this. And now, let's pour it in here. Let me see how hot it is first. And that's fine. Making a, making a deck on this. Put that over here. And cheers! <laughs> Cooper! Honey! Those people across the street, that's not your business? This thing thing. Hey! Hey, 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 hey! I'm lying. The people won't hear you barking and growling. Thank you. Those people. Hey. These furry babies. <laughs> These furry babies are something else. But anywho. Oh, my light, big child. Let them be like, come on, light. Come on, Caroline. So that's it. Butter baby. This is cool enough. I would want to put it in something. Yeah. Let's put in something pretty. I'm still making a mess. Help the Lord. Now that's nice. Cheers! Mm. Mm. I love it. You would love it too. So just imagine of creating a soothing sipping series, uh, session for yourself at any time, any moment. And you can do that to create your relaxing escape, to create your own calming cocktail.